Hi, great people. You are welcome back to Secret Fashioners channel. My name is Fola. Today, I'll be teaching you how to make this uh, trendy, beautiful sleeve made of uh, flans. Let's get started. Now, to make this sleeve, I've come here with my basic uh, sleeve pattern. This is it, and this is what I used to cut out this. So, the next thing I want to do now is to go ahead and cut out my flans. I'll be using like one yard of the, this material to cut out my flans. So, as this one is, I fold it into, into two. I have here with me 24 inches by 24 inches. So, the length and breadth is 24. So, I get the midpoint of uh, 24, which is uh, 12 inches. I get it here as well. So, on this point, I come to this side, which is marking. Five, five inches you can use a uh, six inches i'll be using this uh, three inches krilona This is it, I've cut it out. These two is going to serve for both lining and the main fabric. So the next thing I will do now is that I will go ahead and attach my Krilonite to this, place it, I just pin it down. So that is what I will do, right? Pinning down both the uh, lining and the fabric. This is the wrong side of my fabric so this is how i will pin everything down then after pinning it down i will take it to the machine to go and sew it with a less than quarter of an inch yeah while joining it i will be applying this my uh, hem gum so that by the time i turn it to high on it everything will be laid firm so let me pin down my flowers now this is it I've gone ahead to join my flans together and attaching my krilona inside. You can see I've ironed everything. Everything is already looking beautiful. I've joined the upper part and I've gone ahead to overlock it. So the next thing we want to do now is to move straight to today's business. Uh, how do we place our flans on the basic uh, sleeve? On your basic sleeve, you can measure up like a uh, 1.5 or 1 1 inch after this very line i will mark, mark like a 1.5 1.5 all through to the upper part so i want to rule it that will be a guide for me to know where to place my flans so i will just rule it Your flans can be more than this. So we are just using this to teach. It depends on how full you want it to be.
and one will be placed at the edge here. So what we do is that you you measure like a one inch. Don't let your flans get to this side. Just stop it on that line. So as for you to be able to join it to your bodies. So this is the way our flans is going to be attached to this uh, basic steel. So just take it this way. You are going to be putting a uh, little, little pleats along the line. I'm going to sew it down this way. I will take the next one. I will let the next one be on the next uh, line. The first one, you know, I'm placing the first one on the on the edges of my sleeve. I will place it here. So I will take the second folding. It's going to be on the next line. Just this way. I told you you are going to be uh, applying little, little pleats on it. So I take the next one. The next one will be on the next uh, line. I take the next one this way. So that's how I will be doing it. I will ensure that the last one is attached to the upper edge of my sleeve this way because that one we enter the bodies so this is the way i'm going to place it i'll just go and do that on the machine now and show you the outcome so thereafter we now join the side of our sleeve then we join it to the bodies let me go and touch it now this is it i've gone ahead to place my flans on the basic uh, sleeve and you can see the the outcome i've joined the side of my sleeve and here we have it you can see how beautiful and elegant it it looks i advise you cut out more flans than that which i cut out so as for you to get a more fuller effect so but if you want it this way it's still okay i'm sure you have enjoyed this video Drop your comment on the comment section. Share this video with your friends and family. Subscribe if you have not subscribed. And like this video. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.